All right guys, how you doing? Welcome back to another vlog here on the Hashtag United channel. This is a big one. This is the start of our USA tour. We're at the airport now, we're at Heathrow. We're about to get on the plane. All the Hashtag boys are collecting behind me now. Big squad we're taking, more than 20 people if you include all the crew and stuff we're taking with us. Four games in America. We're gonna vlog behind the scenes on all of them. Obviously the big games going on my channel, Spencer FC as well. Um, we're gonna vlog like one vlog per game so at the end of the first game which we're playing in like 24 hours from now we'll end this vlog there'll be a new one starting which will take us through to the second game so four behind the scenes videos in total which i'm buzzing for um it's gonna be a great trip let's see what lads we've already got with us oh yeah, oh yeah. Is he, he, he's, he's shaved his face look at that suitcase yeah. the state of this guy look at him He's got 1970s sunglasses on. Paul Nash facts. You know what I mean? Are all the Paul Nash facts true? They are all true. Spectacularly. <laughs> don't, know, don't know how they find out all the information, but... Is it true you can speak Braille? Amongst many other uh, things. Give us a bit of Braille. <laughs> you won't understand it, mate. <laughs> <laughs> TJ, Rich Beck, how you doing? You ready for this? Oh, very much so. Very excited. Buzz in, getting some... Oh, what's that? What you got in there? Holiday of the year. Just some chocolate, start chocolate. We've basically got a game in 24 hours, you know that, right? Sorry? We've basically got a game in like 24 hours. Oh, I'm getting the energy on now. Get it in, mate. Yeah, get start it. stretching. <laughs> We've got the old new signing here. Oh, You're not the new signing oh, anymore. Um, You're not the new signing, mate. Your, your hair's not blue anymore, no one's interested, pal. He's, he's doing me. And if, he, if he doesn't score, he's getting a tattoo as well. We heard about this. Here he is, Charlie Morley. He said he's going to get a hashtag tattoo. If he doesn't score, that's big, big promises, mate. Score, so. Yeah, hopefully, hopefully. It's a win-win, even if you don't. Yeah. This guy's already covered head to toe in hashtag tattoos. You can't see him right now, but he's got a whole sleeve of hashtag on his arm here, and he loves a dab as well. Hello, <laughs> <laughs> gang. Al's here too. What position do you want to play on this tour? Uh, I'll play captain, please. Well, that's not really a position, and that's taken as well. <laughs> okay, I'll play um, centre back. Really? You're good in the air. Yeah. You're better than better than Sam Adams. Probably better than Sam Adams anyway. So. What? in the air, that's for sure. Rich Beck and Alex O'Ship show new partnership. I like it. Ready? Ready. We'll talk. Super ready. Only go on the trip. I know, but um, representing the female gender, so we like to represent all genders in these. It's quite handy that we're in Atlanta. So I've got quite a lot of broads in Atlanta. <laughs> I got broads in Atlanta. Just found out that old Charlie Morley just got his first, that was his first ever long haul flight. First time to America. Hopefully he enjoys the trip, gets some goals. We're buzzing with that. Tomorrow, big game. In less than 12 hours, I think it's about 8 p.m. now. About 8 p.m. Atlanta time. Big game tomorrow morning. Could be raining as well. 50% chance of rain, I'm seeing. How do you play in the rain? How do you play in the rain, Charlie? Are you good in the Wait, rain? Raining? Fifty percent, fifty percent chance of rain for the game tomorrow. Fifty. Makes it, makes it harder for defenders. Yeah. So, so you can you can pounce on them here. Yeah, I can indeed. We haven't got. Although he is carrying an injury. Yeah. And I injured myself on the flight. I cut my finger with a plastic knife. Oh my god. It's just Theo. I literally Baker. cut myself. Theobaker.com. <laughs> Never forgets the hashtag. It. Yes. <laughs> Okay, we're waiting for a load of Ubers to get us around because we've got obviously a lot of us here. And then we're going to go to the hotel and basically chill out for the evening. That's what I'm doing anyway, I don't know what everyone else is doing. I don't know what Lou's doing. The Tinder machine. I'm probably going to go check out the talent. Listeners. One day I'm going to marry an American girl, that's a fact. Good flight, boys. Solid. Yeah, not bad. Good flight. Glad to be here. Manage dog? Good flight. 
a big game tomorrow, so I've got to get that pre-match routine in. I've been watching a lot of American football. It's more physical than our game. Uh, they throw it a lot. <laughs> they wear helmets they wear as well. They wear big pads, and apparently goals called touchdowns. So I've got to adapt to that. Sport, so uh, yeah, yeah. So I'll, I'll think yeah. about that tonight. And Just uh, let you know, mate, we're actually playing like what they call soccer, though. You know that, right? Alright. You, you, you touch down if you don't touch it down. You don't actually need those pads you bought in your bag, you can probably get rid of them. I've, I've not packed them on right anything. No. I've massively been missing them. <laughs> <laughs> <It's a laughs> They're very good pads, mate. Take good care of them, driver. Don't need our star striker, Robbie E, getting injured. Wait. Not really a star striker, though. Star right back. We're in the party car with LP, Lewis Preston, and Theo Baker. Just trying to get my belt on. And we've got an absolute so, um, wagon. Oh, wow. Let's do oh. this. Oh, okay, you got this. Get, get the moves out, out. Yes, uh, please. Go on, Lou. This song's a bit of me. I know what that's there. <laughs> okay, Alex and I and all the other players have checked into the hotel now. This is our cheeky little room here in Atlanta. We're going to be here for like three or four days, two matches of football, lots of other activities we've got planned here as well, which I'm really looking forward to. And uh, then, of course, we go to New York for the second part of the tour, the second half, and two more games over there. So I'm buzzing, to be honest, but it's a tricky one because you've got all the sort of excitement of being in another country, just getting off the plane, all your mates being here, wanting to like have fun. But then the reality of the fact that we're playing football in about 12 hours, we're pretty knackered because I don't know about everyone else, but I didn't sleep on the plane. So we have to really just go to bed. We have to just sort of chill out now, go to maybe get some food, go to bed, get up early. We've got a meet in the lobby downstairs at 8 a.m., Atlanta the time, and then the kickoff is at 10 a.m. Hopefully, in about 14, 15 hours from now, we'll have three more points for hashtag United and a big win, and our first win in America. But before all that, though, I do want to say a massive thank you to someone called Dan uh, from a company called Never A Wasted Journey. They're a travel company, and they've helped us with all the logistics, the flights, the hotels, everything. I mean, for 20-odd people, it's a lot of work to do for this tour. And without them, this would have been a lot harder to do. So if you're ever in the lookout for a travel company, Never A Wasted Journey, I highly recommend them. Check them out in the description. All right. I also, of course, want to say a big thank you to Coca-Cola for having us out here on this Coca-Cola US tour. They have made the whole thing possible, guys. Guys. They are basically letting me and my mates live out our football dreams, so legends. Okay, change of plan guys. We thought we were having a quiet night in, but the lads want to go out and get some chicken apparently. Somewhere called Gus's, Gus's Chicken. Gus's Chicken. Our Uber driver recommended this place. So we're going to go get some chicken with the other lads. And uh, hopefully not have too late at one though. I, I can't stress that enough. Someone has to be the sensible one on this trip. If that has to be me, that's fine. That's why I'm here. There's going to be plenty of nights for craziness as well. Yeah. We've got like two days in New York without a game, so we can do whatever we want then. But Tomorrow, we, st we have to start big. We have to start big. So we'll get some chicken, have a few little bits of banter, and then we'll go to bed. And we're back at the hotel. Sunday. Tomorrow, yes, big game, first game in America, playing Coca-Cola. Predictions? I'm, I'm always going to go back and hashtag win. Always. Yeah? Yeah, always going to go hashtag win. I reckon, I reckon a bit of start of tour nerves might come into effect. Maybe 2-1 hashtag? 2 one, I'll take it, mate. I'll take a win any day of the week. Got to get the three points on the table. Right, we're back in the hotel. Got my kit for tomorrow. First ever time wearing the brand new Hashtag United Home shirt. I'm buzzing to try it on, but I really hope we do it justice. I really hope we get the win. Come on, boys. Alex, prediction for tomorrow? Prediction, I'm going to say, it's going to be a difficult game. I'm going to say 2-1. That's what Saunders yeah. said. Saunders did 2-1 as well. We're in sync. Imagine if it actually is 2-1, that'd be crazy. According to some chats we had some of the guys tonight that have been talking to the Coca-Cola guys, apparently, they might have called in a few ringers. I mean, they've got a lot of staff to choose from. Their, their whole of their Coca-Cola World HQ is here in Atlanta, yeah? So they've got thousands and thousands of staff, but also they've got a lot of connections with footballers and people. And who knows, you never know. They could, have, they could turn up with some really good players. So we've got to just do what we do every single time and play our own game. We, we could be okay. Just get some sleep and then we'll see you in the morning. Hashtag, 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 hashtag. hashtag. Breakfast time. How are we feeling, boys? Okay. 
Yeah. Feeling good? Good donut in the morning. Yeah, yeah. Donut? That's an athlete's two, diet right there. Two, two, two donuts for Theo Baker. If it works, mate, if you score, you can eat all the donuts you want, pal. You have more because you paid $25. $25 for two donuts. Bloody hell. <laughs> they taste like $25? They taste like $50. Ooh. Did have a I've gone with a little bit of fruit sex, uh, selection here. Banana. A bit of oatmeal. Let's do it. LP. Predictions for today. 3-0. 3-0? Easy. Easy. The goal scorers? Dan Brown hat-trick. Dan Brown hat-trick. Unstoppable. Manager Dog, what are you saying? Getting some vitamin water? Getting revived. 4-0. Start America um, on fire. Smash it up. I think Ryan Adams is going to thrive on US soil. Decent. Jacko, what are you saying? These guys are saying 3-0, 4-0. Take a win, mate. Win's a win. Clean sheet and a win. Like yeah. it. Let's do it. Right, guys, I'm ready. Nearly time to go. I'm buzzing for this. Uh, look what's arrived, by the way, before we do go. This is sick. The guys from Powerade have sent us these care package. Every single player and the crew have got one of these, including, look at that, hashtag United FC Powerade bottle. Love that. Got this bag. What's inside? Decent Xbox controller. I actually love this controller. I've got that at home already, so I might give this away. If hashtag win today, I'll give that away. Oh, my God. It is a hashtag United Coke. That is crazy. I love that. What else we got? Smart water, decent. Need some water, gotta keep hydrated for the match. Lovely. Another one of these bad boys, unbelievable. Got two, just in case. Decent, I might give that one away as well. Yeah, what one each. One for me, one for you guys. Got a cap in here. What's this? It's a $50 voucher. Visa gift card. I rate that. Mate, they're sorting us right out. There's more stuff in here still. T-shirt, just a kid from London, Powerade. Little t-shirt banner, lovely. And finally we've got a little card here. Big thanks to Coke Esports for sending this, legends. Uh, and we've got the bag as well, of course. I am loving that, but now we're going to football mode. Now it's time to get in the lobby, go to the match and do this. We've got to win our first game, kick things off as we mean to carry on. Come on, hashtag. Right, we're in the Uber on the way to the match. Boys, are you ready? We're ready. Can we get a, a score prediction from the Uber driver? Yeah, it's high. What's the score, what's the score gonna be? <laughs> Score goals, but um, I don't know. Say, you, guys are, you guys are gonna win. Say, yeah. hashtag United are gonna win. Hashtag they're gonna win. That'll do. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Right, we have arrived. It's a decent facility. The weather's not great, unfortunately. It's raining a little bit. This is a, this is actually a quality facility. To be fair. There's loads of pictures over the other side of that. I see some 3G through the middle there, and then we've got the pitch we're playing on here. It's not bad. It's not bad at all. This is the university team that play here. Yeah. Got a bit of water on the corner flag there, it's going to be an interesting one. Here we are, hiding underneath here. What's going on boys? Chilling. Come chill. on, we're getting some of these little... Look, he's going to be a cameraman. Look at him, look at him. Look at him, look at him. Is that a panoramic, Dan? We do have some slight concerns with puddles here. I don't even know if I can walk in that. It's pretty deep to be fair. It's pretty deep. Look, it's going onto the pitch as well. This could be an issue. I'm not going to lie. This could be an issue. Look at this. Playing left side of the pitch, you're in trouble. Or on the flanks in general. Need some brooms to get rid of all this, really. Just to sweep it off. Yeah, there's a little bit of water logging. The other side looks okay. It's a decent pitch, though. I mean, it's dry. This will be decent. Quality there from Seb. Good workout. First thoughts on the pitch. I like it. A lot of colourful seats here. I think there's some boxes there. Theo ending his vlog there. Mug. More seats there. Floodlights. Decent. If anyone that said all that YouTube fame has gone to his head, take it back. This is a man who gets down in the trenches when he can't play on the pitch. He works behind the scenes, putting his blood, sweat, and tears on the line for the hashtag badge. Go on, Theo. Drive! Drive! <laughs> Look at that face. Good work, mate. Very good. Uh, Theo, you missed a bit, mate. Just there. Just this up rest a bit. <laughs> Wait for a big end. Big ending. Big run. That was a bit of an anti-climax, mate, if I'm honest. Me and Theo are walking up here and then up there to get to around about there. 
and get some decent photos of this. I may be injured, but I can still do this. Me and Theo just walked to the top. Look at this. This is this is college grounds. Wow. I don't know if there's any universities in the, in the UK that have these sort of facilities because they have this and they have some more pictures over here and then they have some more pictures here. Wow. I should have went to the university here. Wait, let's, let's leave England, get a football scholarship, go USA, become MLS bowlers. Down of the day. Deal. Come on guys, come on!